So today <clears throat> we are in Matthew chapter 26, 1 through 25. Um, we are here at Prayer Pond Ministries, Joppa Ranch in Lyons, Georgia. And let's see here. Um, the book of Matthew has focused on the work that Jesus had come to do. Now, this chapter is the longest chapter in the gospel, so we're going to divide it into two parts. Today, we're in verses 1 through 25, and then every incident uh, in detail that point to the cross. So, um, this is the end of Jesus' teaching of the kingdom. And now he's going to move to the act that he came to accomplish. Death for our sins. He has already told the disciples that he would suffer and die. And now he reminds them that the time has come for these things to be fulfilled. The fact that Jesus would die during Passover was very significant um, with respect to Jewish history. The Passover commemorated the night that the Israelites were freed from Egypt, Exodus chapter 12, when God passed over the homes and that were marked with the blood of the lamb. This event foreshadowed, it was a type and shadow of Jesus's work on the cross. Now, as the spotless Lamb of God, Jesus' blood would be spilled in order to save his people. He was saving them from the penalty of death because of sin. 